hello foodies today i'm going to show you guys a very simple potato curry that can be enjoyed with chapati idli roti and rice so let's get started these are the ingredients that we need for this recipe i'll tell you one by one along with the measurements while adding it first pressure cook the potatoes and green peas i already added four cups of water and here i'm adding one cup of green peas and one cup of potatoes next here i'm adding little salt and half a tablespoon of turmeric now pressure cook for about three to four whistles now the green peas and potatoes are cooked keep it aside for about five minutes and then take the potatoes out now let it cool for some time meanwhile add tomatoes into mixer jar and grind into your fine paste here I have taken two large tomatoes. Now heat the pan and add six tablespoons of oil. Once the oil is hot, add cumin. Once the cumin half roasted, add chopped onions. Here I have taken two large onions. Now add a little salt and saute it till the onions are transparent. Now add 2 spoons of ginger garlic paste and saute for about 3 minutes. Now I'm adding 1 tablespoon of turmeric, 1 tablespoon of curry masala powder, 1 tablespoon of chili powder, 1 tablespoon of coriander powder and giving it a quick and nice mix for about a minute on medium flame. Now add the ground tomato paste and let it cook for about 8 to 10 minutes on medium flame. Now smash the potatoes, add into the gravy and mix it well. Note: Before smashing, just take 4-5 to five pieces and keep it aside. If the gravy is too thick, you can add some water. Now add remaining potatoes and green peas. After adding everything, just adjust the spices according to your taste. And let it cook for about 10 minutes on medium flame. Now the gravy is ready to serve. Please do try this recipe and share your feedback in the comment section below. Thank you for watching.